Hey guys, it's me Jasmine. Welcome back to my channel and if you're new, welcome to my channel. Don't forget to hit that big red button to subscribe and the little bell next to it to get notified whenever I post a new video. In today's video, I'm going to be teaching you guys how to do a spiral in figure skating. So, big shout out to whoever requested this video. Big shout out to Megan Bream who requested this video. And I can't wait to start teaching you guys, so let's get into the video. So, first we're going to start with some off-ice exercises. So, what we're going to do is we're going to find a wall and that you can place your leg up on. And I'm going to place my backward leg that I'm going to be having in the air for my spiral onto the wall. And you can either bend your leg if the wall is too short or keep it straight if the wall is high enough. But the wall has to be high enough so that your leg is above hip level. So if it's too short, then just bend your leg. And then you're going to repeat that on the other side. So next, you're going to move to a wall or anything that you can hold on to and then kick your leg up around 10 or 20 times, it depends all on you, up into a spiral position and you want to try and get your leg as high as you possibly can because the higher you can get it here, the better it'll help on the ice. So next what we're going to do is we're going to turn to this side, still holding on to a wall, lift your leg up in the back as high as you possibly can, and then just bend your standing leg 10 to 20 times. Again, it all depends on how much you want to do. Then repeat the same thing on the other side. So now we get to move on to the ice. And once we're on the ice, you want to do the same thing that we did off ice, where you put your leg up onto the board, and then you want to, if the board is too low, you're going to bend your knees like I'm showing you here. But if it's perfectly high enough, then you don't have to. But if you want to, you can. And once you feel you have a steady balance, you can let go of the wall to practice your balance on your spiral. So some examples of poor spiral position is leaning too far forward so that you can't that your toe pick is dug, digging into the ice and that you can't stand up and also that your free legs toe pick is pointing downward. And the correct spiral position what you are doing is you have to make sure that you're not pushing too far forward and that your free leg is turned upwards or to the side so that it looks so much prettier and it is easier to hold your leg up. So some ways that you're not supposed to do a spiral is mainly to not bend over and then lift your leg up. This is one of the most common mistakes that I see most people doing and you want to make sure that it's a one like seesaw motion. Also, you want to make sure that your foot is turned to the side because it's so much easier to get your foot up higher that way and it's easier to hold your spiral. So some examples of how to do a correct spiral is you want to lean over and your leg go up at the same time, kind of like a seesaw motion like I just said. 
And also, if you take a look, you can notice that my foot is turned to the side. It's not facing downwards, and this is how I can get my free leg up so high. And that's how you do a spiral. I hope you guys liked that video. I want you guys to comment down below which one of your favorite figure skaters has an amazing spiral. Also, don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on notifications. Love you guys. Bye.